Good afternoon and welcome to One Line at Five, the Boston Standards Video Bulletin Show. My name is Duncan Brown. Health professionals in Boston have joined the fight to save the town's training pool. Staff members at Boston's Pilgrim Hospital have been putting their names to a petition that calls for the Rowley Road facility to be spared for the good of the town's health. Boston Borough Council has earmarked £2.2 million to bring the Jeff Mulder Leisure Centre up to date, but currently the training pool is deemed too costly to run. Dancers from the AJ Dance School in Bennington have raised £3,000 for charity through their five-year anniversary show, Tutus, Taps and Tiaras. The show features students aged from 3 to 70 plus who performed routines in stunning costumes in a wide variety of dance styles from ballet dancing to ballet dancing. The sun has been, split, sun has been split between the Marie Curie Rapid Response Team and St Barnabas Hospice. One in, one out at York Street. Boston United have signed six foot five striker Danny Davidson. The former Dalby County trainee put pen to paper last night at training. However, Tyrone Kirk has left the club after agreeing a six month deal with League Two side Macclesfield Town. We end with the weather and light rain is predicted for tomorrow, so don't forget your max. Thank you very much for watching. See you soon. Goodbye.